Welcome to the TradingView mobile app where we are currently starting on the watch list and we will work our way through the chart, explore, ideas, and menu. Starting with the watch list, take a look at the symbols we have added here, including Tesla, Apple, Alphabet, NVIDIA, the QQQ ETF, and BTC USD. The point here is you can add multiple symbols to your watch list and across all asset classes. So if we wished, we can click at a symbol, as you just saw, then type in the symbol name and add that symbol to our watch list. And just like that, we have now added a Forex pair to our watch list as well. We have crypto, ETFs, stocks, and a Forex pair. We could add futures as well. Keep in mind, you could have multiple watch lists and you can manage them all right here at the top left. And for example, here are all of the different watch lists that we manage with different points and reasons for creating such watch lists. We can also add color flags to specific symbols to sort them in another custom way that we wish. Let's click back here, go back to our watch list, because now we want to show you that if you tap a symbol on your watch list, you're going to get a wonderful preview that looks like this. You even have some preset timeframes that you can quickly access at the bottom. And of course, if you wish to add an alert, you can click the alert icon and very quickly add an alert, customize the price as needed, any level that you want, and just like that, we've set an alert. There's also a buy button if you have a connected brokerage, and you could go to the main chart as well and see some key stats and details at the bottom. Let's go ahead and go back to our watch list though, because now that we've covered the watch list, we want to make sure that we take you to the chart. We're going to tap the chart icon, and now we are on the chart that many of you have come to learn, love, and master. So what we did just there is we moved to a different time frame. So once you do get familiar with your chart, you can very quickly access different time frames for you depending on your trading style or what it is that you want to see. So we just bounced around there from different time frames, including getting to a daily chart. It now says one day. So that's the first thing to know. Next up is that you can change the symbol at any point in time at the bottom left with a tap. And symbol, similar to adding a symbol to your watch list, just go ahead and type in the name of that symbol and you can have that chart very quickly added front and center on your mobile screen. You're also going to notice some key details here. We can see some indicators that are added to our chart. We can see a sell button and a buy button if we're mobile trading the name of the company and the price. Keep in mind, this is your price scale on the right. This is your time scale at the bottom. And at any point you wish, you can customize all of this by clicking the settings menu to customize the chart in the best way that works for you. Now, at the very bottom, you're also going to notice off to the right, this is where you can access your alerts, your drawing tools, and much more. If we click the plus icon, we can very quickly add drawing tools. We can add indicators alerts, compare multiple symbols, symbols, access templates, add this symbol to our watch list, share a chart picture, or create an idea. You have the capabilities to access all of this once you have our mobile app and you click the plus button. For example, if you wanted to add an indicator to the chart, just click indicators, go ahead and search for the indicator that you are looking for. How about we type in Bollinger Bands? Many of you are familiar with Bollinger Bands. There they are. We're gonna click, let's exit out, and we've now added Bollinger Bands to our chart, and we can see that on this exact view. Of course, there is this drawing icon as well, and if you want to draw on your chart a trend line, a Fibonacci retracement, or anything else that scrolls across this menu or up and down, you can access that as well. This means you can do drawings directly from your mobile device. The three dots here are the final thing we want to show you, because of course, this will let you optimize your full screen mode, connect a broker, get some security details. If you're looking at a stock, you can access financials, forecasts, technicals, chart type, and alert management. So there is quite a bit to learn and master here. And probably the key things to take away from the chart feature when you have it selected is to know you can change your symbol here, change your time interval here, add indicators and drawings and other tools like alerts with the plus, access some customizations related to drawing tools and the entire drawing tool menu with the drawing tool icon. And then of course, when you're ready to go a bit deeper and access some more details, for example, why don't we look at technicals? You can use the three dots at the bottom, right? To see this data as well.
Moving on, we can click the Explore tab to read about different asset classes that interest us. So as you can see here, we just went to Economy, Bonds, Futures, Forex, and we can see some important prices and news flow right before our eyes. Moving off to ideas, well, the social network on TradingView does publish ideas. We can look at editors' picks to see what the editors are picking. We can see who we're following or sort by the asset class or region of the world. As we wrap up this video, it's important to remind you that in the menu, you can see everything about your profile. So if you wish to make changes to your profile, see who you are, see what links you're showing, that's all just a tap away. And then of course, you've got your news here, your economic calendar, chats, settings. Once again, you can scroll down to access some other important features to follow us and to learn more about the mobile app. But we do want to take a second to show you the economic calendar because if you happen to be a Forex trader or a macro trader, you're going to want to know where to see this so that you can see all of the upcoming events. Let's tap menu to go back. And now, ladies and gentlemen, with that being said, we have introduced you to our mobile app, starting with the watch list and how to add symbols to your watch list, moving on to the chart and all of the features you love, especially around adding indicators, drawings, tracking your favorite symbols, and of course, changing symbols effortlessly or the time interval effortlessly. And no matter where you are on the planet, as long as you have a stable internet connection, you can access these symbols and watch them trade. Then for more information, use the Explore and Ideas tab to meet other traders and learn about markets, get some interesting news articles, and your menu is of course specifically for you and the things that are relevant to the things that you want to follow across markets or change within your profile. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for watching. We hope that this mobile video gets you started. This is how you can utilize the platform and get started from anywhere, once again, as long as you have an internet connection.